What up, YouTube? I'm your boy, J Tunes, and welcome back to another foot draft to bail. Now, guys, in the last episode, we didn't do too good in the draft, right? We didn't get far at all, and honestly, I haven't been playing that great of FIFA lately, so it's my fault. But I've been practicing, I've been playing more FIFA, but still not doing that great. But I'm hoping that's going to change in today's episode. But anyway, guys, in the last episode, we didn't do too good in the draft. We didn't pack anything, but after selling everything, including stuff that we've had from past uh, videos that finally has sold we made 11,775 coins that puts us at a grand total of 136,601 coins that means from the last time I checked how much bail is that we can actually afford striker bail which I thought was going for 136k I'm not really sure I haven't checked and the reason being is this guys we're gonna do one more draft here just to see if we can get a little bit more coins and uh, I need to know what player you guys want to go after next. You guys need to leave that down below. We've gotten Neymar. We've gotten Striker Bale. Now, what player are we going after next? You guys leave it down below. Anyway, guys, if you don't know how this series works, it's pretty damn simple. We're trying to see how many drafts it actually takes to get in a certain player. In this case, it was Striker Bale or is Striker Bale. And, uh, and I'm the one that pays to end up getting into the drafts. We don't use... Uh, if I use coins, that comes out of me, not out of our balance. If I use points, of course, I'm the one paying for it. So we're just trying to see exactly how many drafts it's going to take. I think this is draft either 16 or 17. Uh, but anyway, enough about all that good stuff. Let's go ahead and jump right into this draft here. And hopefully, we'll actually get far in this draft. And hopefully, I can actually pack something good. Uh, we get the 4-3-3, 4-3-3 defending. Four, you know what? I'm just going to go with the 4-3-3. Um, let's just go with the standard 4-3-3 there, guys. I love that 4 all right, guys, let's go ahead and take a moment to talk about FIFA 17. I know we're in the middle of a draft, but I didn't know of any other better way to do this. So we're going to talk uh, about it during the drafting process. Now, I did the whole drafting live, but of course, you're not going to be able to hear that. You're going to hear me talking a little bit about the new trailer that just came out for FIFA 17. Some stuff that a lot of people are talking about, some things that I missed the first time around. And, uh, of course, some things I'm interested about and I want to get your guys' opinion on as well. So, during the draft, guys, you're going to hear me talking about FIFA 17 and then we'll get right into the gameplay. So, as you guys know, yesterday, June 6th, uh, the, the trailer was released and it gave us some pretty good ideas of what's going on. So, as we know, for FIFA 17, there's going to be a brand new engine. The Frostbite engine is going to be used to make or is already been used to make FIFA 17. And, and, honestly, I haven't played a game with this engine before, but I know Battlefield 4 was made with it i don't play battlefield but i heard uh, the graphics well i've seen the graphics graphics are amazing i heard the gameplay is good but every time fifa switches engines it doesn't turn out too well for the gameplay and i'm hoping that's going to be different this time around i'm hoping that it looks well i, I feel like it's going to look amazing and we'll see some of those clips here in a minute I, I, but i don't know if the gameplay is going to be good and i'm hoping it is so like i was saying guys frostbit is a uh, frostbit frostbite is the new engine and with that, we have some amazing looking graphics. Now, like I said, the first time that I saw this, I saw this on my iPhone, so I wasn't really, really impressed when I came back to see it and looking at the graphics. When you see Hazard's face pop up, it actually looks like freaking Hazard. It looks realistic as hell, and I missed that completely. I'm being honest, when I first watched the trailer, I actually thought they were the players, like the real life people doing these clips and, 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 and all this stuff. Like, as you can see there with Anthony, I honestly thought it was him jumping up for the ball they used a clip or something but looking at this guys the realism of of the players and, and the graphics look amazing so damn good i can't wait to get my hands on fifa 17 to see how clean it's gonna look i'm hoping the gameplay is gonna look clean and it's, the graphics are gonna be amazing now there are some things that i think are gonna be kind of cool with the implements well basically the pictures that they showed us right the little hallway of the Chelsea I guess locker rooms or whatever I, I don't even know what hallway that is to be fair I don't know what that is but that hallway looks real it looks amazing and that leads me into the dressing rooms guys this to me makes it look like they're going to be revamping career mode with the way this is looking anyway and that would be fantastic if they change and add uh, some things to career mode which they haven't touched career mode in the longest time and I'm hoping that they change it and make it better than what it is because I do enjoy playing Kareem and I know a lot of you guys out there enjoy it as well. So adding dressing rooms in like this, just it just looks amazing, guys. I, I honestly, first time around, wasn't too excited looking at these pictures and watching the trailer over and over and over again got me super excited for the next trailer that comes out on June 12th. Uh, on June 12th, right? 
Uh, so I can't wait for that. I'm probably going to do like a, a reaction to that. I was planning on doing one with this one, but I wasn't uh, around a computer to do so. So that's the reason why I couldn't. But as you guys see there, we have the locker room. We have the realism of, I honestly thought that was real. I thought that was, you know, it, it looks like Mourinho to me. I thought it was Mourinho walking around. They had a clip of that, but nope, that is actually gameplay. I'm excited guys. I am super excited. This frost bit engine looks amazing. The graphics look sick. I'm hoping it all is going to be amazing. I just hope, you know, the gameplay is going to be better. I'm hoping the gameplay is going to be good. Also, guys, we also did get some more information about the pre-ordering, which I'm also excited about because as you guys can see there, we have the standard edition, the deluxe, and the super deluxe, which you get all the normal stuff. You get your, your jumbo premium packs for, for UT, but you also get special edition kits. I am excited to see what's going to happen. Uh, I'm hoping that they'll have more kits implemented throughout uh, the whole season, the whole year of FIFA 17, adding to customizing uh, our teams a little bit and getting maybe rare kits that other players can't get or, or the more you play, you'll be able to get something. You're rewarding people that play the game a lot and kits is one way to do it. I'm hoping they do other things as well. Of course, I am going to be pre-ordering me for the Super Deluxe for FIFA 17. I honestly can't wait until September 20, uh, 29th for it to release. Now guys, you guys let me know what you think is going to be improved in FIFA 17. I'm hoping honestly that they revamp career mode. I'm also hoping that they fix uh, the foot draft. I hope they add to the foot draft. I hope they add a little bit more randomness to the foot draft. I enjoy playing with the best players, but I'm sick of always getting uh, BBVA or La Liga, whichever you want to call it, to pop all the time and basically forcing you to go that way. I want more randomness or not even more randomness. I want if you choose, say, Robin as your captain, I want more Germans to pop. You know what I mean? More players from the German league to pop just so you can build a squad around them or even from uh, League One. You know, when Eber pops, you take them, but then nothing else links. I'm sick of that. I want more in the draft. Those are the only two things that I'm honestly looking forward to. Hopefully, uh, they are going to revamp career mode and make it, you know, the graphics, the way the graphics look, I hope they take that all the way to its potential and more. I hope the gameplay is fantastic. Uh, but those are the only two main things that I would like to see. Of course, there's other little things here and there that I would love to see, like the kits and, and, and rewarding people that actually play more than uh, casuals, I guess. But let me know what you think and what you would like to see improved in FIFA 17 down below. Um, and, and guys, uh, I, I know this is not normal, but I really wanted to talk about FIFA 17. I'm super excited about it. The graphics look amazing. Everything just looks fantastic to me, and I can't wait to get my hands on it. I can't wait to see uh, more of these trailers and more of, of the gameplay. That's honestly what we want to see, right, is the gameplay and how it's going to be. The graphics and screenshots of graphics and and screen and, and like the screens and stuff are going to be cool to see, but I want to see what the gameplay is going to be like. But I'm really, really hoping that they start improving other aspects of FIFA as well. Love uh, that they, you know, impl implemented uh, the foot draft this year, but I'm hoping they can improve on that, improve a little bit on everything in the game, not just on one part of the game. Hopefully with this engine, that's going to work, guys. Let me know. Do you guys think that it's smart switching engines? Do you think the Frost uh, Bike engine is going to do well with FIFA 17? Let me know all your opinions down below, guys. Hopefully you guys uh, are excited. I I'm truly, truly excited. I wasn't. I tweeted out, and if you guys follow me on Twitter, if you don't follow me on Twitter, guys, go make sure at JTunes Gaming. But I tweeted out like it didn't reveal too much, and honestly, it's because I wasn't paying attention. It revealed a lot. Can't wait till the 12th of June to see it. I'm super, super excited, and I can't believe that it's almost here. Only 113 or 12 days, guys. It's almost here. I can't wait. I want to play FIFA 17 right now. Can we just like, can I get a free copy? Yo, EA, if you're listening, bro, beta test, please? Come on, bro. I won't say nothing. I just want to play the damn thing. <laughs> anyway, guys, uh, let's go ahead and jump right into uh, the draft itself and, and into the gameplay. But as you guys can see there, we had a 187 at the end of that draft. Um, I, I didn't draft that well. We didn't get that many great players to pop. But let's see what we can do with that team that we have. Hopefully, we can make it to the final. Hopefully, we can pack something amazing. Let's find out. Let's go ahead and jump right into the gameplay. Let's do this. All right, guys. So here we go. We're going up against the 4-3-3, the third variation, 90 rated squad, 97 chem. 
Uh, very solid looking side. A lot of a lot of Liga there with a little bit of League One there with Ibra and Cavani uh, up front. So a little scary, uh, especially with Ibra up there. But I think we should be able to deal with it. We have a pretty solid squad. As long as I can score some goals, we should be fine. Just trying to get it forward. Bruno now. Get in, Messi! No way he's off! Come on! No way! Please, ref, don't do this to me! He was on for sure, bro! We find Benzema. Benzema looking for a little bit of space here to pass to Ronaldo. He finds it, he sweats it, and Bruno puts it in, baby! It's 1-0! I don't care about the sweating, guys. I want a goal, I want to win, and I'm going to do it any way I can. <laughs> Beautiful stuff there from Ronaldo to Bruno, and we're up by one. Up and over, finding Bruno. Benzema, yes, baby, there it is! The 45th! Benzema finds space, puts it in. We're up by one, oh, two. I was going to say one. We're up by two. <laughs> Nicely done there from our team. All right, Benzema steals it. Benzema, yes. Benzema steals it, takes the shot. I honestly thought the keeper had a touch on that, but it still goes in. I honestly thought it had gone wide, but steals it, finds a little bit of space, takes the shot there, and what a beautiful finish there in the upper corner of the goal. Can we get another? And we do. We can get another one. Easy, guys. Nice and easy now. I don't think my opponent really wants to play anymore. I think he's demotivated. Uh, just not playing like he was in the first half, allowing easy, easy areas for me to get in and just passing it in the back here, waiting for me to steal it, I guess, and then I just put it into the back of the net. It's, it's, it's pretty simple right now. That's a great ball. Oh, that's a beautiful goal. Just a little bit of skill, finds it, and he puts it in. <laughs> oh, man. Crossing it in, little messy, nowhere to be found. Rakitic now, and there it is, guys. That is going to be the end of the match. We win our first game here. We're moving on to the second match of the draft. Three more to go. Hopefully, we can make it to the final. Hopefully, we can win. It's been a while since we did so. All right, guys, so here we go. Our opponent did pretty damn well. We took seven shots on target, nine shots in total. We did pretty good. Our opponent, not bad. Two shots, one goal, or one shot win it. He got himself one goal there. We have 53% possession of the possession, so not bad at all. Messi, guys, wasn't too involved. I have to give him more involved in the, the game. Honestly, I didn't even use him once, and that's why I like the more narrow formations because I honestly don't play out wide, and that's why Messi wasn't involved too much in this game, but hopefully that will change in the next. Let's go ahead and jump right in. All right, guys, so here we go. We're going up against the 4-3-3, the fourth variation of 198. Uh, or excuse me, a 189 uh, side here. A very strong La Liga side, honestly. A better squad than I think I have, to be honest. Uh, except for maybe uh, he's a little shaky in defense, but so am I, to be honest. But uh, hopefully we can get through this game, move on to the next, get a good pack for once. That's what all I'm... All, really, I want, guys, I don't even care if I win the draft. I just really want a good pack. I haven't had a good pack in ages in FIFA. Suarez finding Ronaldo here. Good cross in, Suarez. Just walks it in. Just walks it in. You gotta be kidding me. Just walks it in with Suarez. There we go. Come on. Oh my god, Benzema. You steal it beautifully, but your finish was not on point. Fine, Bruno. We need to get Bruno more involved. Benzema now. Benzema now. Benzema now. Ties it up, baby. He ties it all up by his lonesome. Well, he got a beautiful through ball, but a nice ball there from Bruno. He just muscles himself a little bit of space there, Benzema, and finesses around the keeper to tie it all up. All right, we find Iniesta. Looking to cross it in. Oh, ho, ho! how'd you miss? How did you miss, Ronaldo? Get this back, up and over again. There we go. Somewhat not working well the way I planned it. Suarez by himself. Get out of here, game. Come on, dude. Seriously? Come on, Ben. Yes! 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 Mistake made by him. And we capitalize on it, guys. There it is. All tied up. 
Benzema with the beautiful finish there. Finally, something falls our way and we put it in. It's all open in there for him. Come on. I like how my whole team pushed forward and just left a gap for Ronaldo to get through. My whole team went up chasing Neymar. One player destroyed my whole defense. Come on, yes, baby! Benzema does it again! Benzema does it again! With just a little bit of space, he puts it in. Oh, man. No way. No! Just pass it off. No! No! We played so well! We we're always playing from behind! And we get it in the 90th Suarez. A mistaken defense on my part, guys, and he puts it away. Come on! All right, guys, so we end up losing here. We had 12 shots, seven on target. Our opponent was six shots, six on target. We had more possession. Uh, honestly, looking at stats, we probably deserved the game, but our opponent comes out with the victory here. We are only going in. God, man. We should have had that poor defending in the last, the last moments of the game. And he puts it away to finish that off, man. Oh, my goodness. We played well. I can't be too disappointed about that, but I'm still very, very disappointed. Hopefully, our pack luck will be okay. It's not. It's not going to be good at all. It's not going to be good at all. Let's see what we get for our first gold pack here, guys. Come on. Please just give me something. Nope, nothing. <laughs> Gives me nothing. All right. Let's go ahead and grab all this here, and we'll send it to... Um... We'll send all this, of course, uh, to the transfer list. I don't think anything else is going to sell here, so we're going to go ahead and quick sell, guys, for 1,051 coins. All right, guys, so for our second gold pack, or our premium gold pack, I should say, let's go ahead and open up. This is the second pack that we won for, or the rewards that we got for, and we get nothing. Great. Great. Super happy. Super happy. All right, guys, we'll send all of this to the trade list or the trade pile, I should say. Everything else is going to be quick sold for 1,023 coins. All right, guys, and for our silver players pack here, we are going to get, well, I don't care. I don't care what we get in silver packs. Honestly, yep, and nothing that I'm too worried about. Anything that does have pace, though, I will try to sell. Um, anything that does have pace, I will try. Actually, you might sell as well. Uh, I will try to sell here just to make a little bit of coin so we'll send that all to the transfer list go ahead and quick sell everything else for 420 coins all right guys so the draft we drafted pretty decently we had a full a very strong la liga side uh but we end up losing in the last couple of moments our opponent was not a bad opponent at all he played very very well i paid a poor in defense and that's why i got scored on so many times but um it is what it is guys there's nothing i can do the only thing i can do is try again in the next draft to actually win one I, I need to, like, I'm on a streak right now where I'm not winning a lot of FIFA. I need to get back on the streak where I was winning a lot of FIFA. I gotta practice more. Anyway, guys, hopefully you guys have enjoyed today's episode. If you have, please smash a like. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Deuces, baby. <laughs>